So the mindset that brings you into a flow with the universe is where you start noticing, you start accepting that you are part of this world that you live in and that it's actually a conscious and intelligent being that is communicating to you. It actually is you. You are this reality. So people are like, what does what that even mean? You, your consciousness is a higher vibration than just the atoms in your body. Like the actual interaction between the atoms in your body and between the cells in your body creates this field of consciousness. And that field of consciousness is more closely related to the way that the universe actually functions than say just an individual cell or an organism, right? And so the infinite mind that is dreaming up this universe, because that's all it is, it's just an illusion, it's a dream. The infinite mind that's dreaming all this is correspondently similar to your field of consciousness. So the same way that you can think and imagine, that's the creator's way of creating this universe. So in that sense, every thought that you have is actually the creator's thought because the creator is literally imagining you right now. You are the creator. Let's do an exercise. Imagine a little character in your brain right now doing something. And it can be anything. There's no, there's no wrong answer here. So just imagine a being or a creature or a person or something in your mind, okay? And just pick one, doesn't even matter which one, and just have it do something. And it doesn't matter what it's having to do, okay? So what's it doing? Um, the first time I thought of this, I think I thought of like this big fuzzy ball creature and I had it like rolling around and hopping around. And the question that I posed myself was, from the creature's perspective, from the fuzzy ball's perspective, who is choosing to make it hop up and down? Obviously, from its perspective, it's choosing to hop up and down. So, from the creature's perspective, if I'm being honest, the creature was hopping on its own will, its own fruition. So, I am actually giving, I'm imbuing a creature with will, but it's still an illusion. I'm still the one choosing to hop up and down in the form of this character. Do you see how this, through the law of correspondence, which says as above, so as below, as below, so as above, this, we are the same being and we share a will. And so your will is the creator's will. Do you see that? It is, it is a direct connection with the creator. Anything you choose to do, the creator is choosing to do through you. It's pretty mind blowing. 